Okay, this is just a quick tutorial on how to read a frequency diagram. Now, we've got a frequency polygon here. You could have like a, um, a bit of a bar chart but without gaps. They're called histograms, right, instead. But you normally see these. This is a frequency polygon. I'll write that down. Frequency polygon, all right. So, oops, there we go, polygon. All right, now, uh, each point is plotted in the middle of a group. So, there we go. So, they're the points that have been plotted, and they're just joined up with straight lines. Now, if I was to look at, say, this one here, that is at, and hold on, I think that goes up in twos, it does. So, that is 16, but the group, right, so the frequency that group is 16 and the group is from 20 to 29.9 all right so not 20 to 30 because then the next one will be 30 to 40 and if you actually got bang on 30 all right then you wouldn't know which uh, group to go in so you have to do it a bit like that if you put 20 to 30 you might get away with it if you're very lucky all right but 20 to 29.9 um, they'll probably give you a table next to it but that's that's basically how it works now if I just change the color and I'll do one more so if we do say uh, this last one here okay there that frequency is uh, what's that two all right but the group would be 40 to 49.9 okay so that's the sort of thing we need to do. It's continuous data, remember. Um, one group goes straight on to the next one without any gaps.